Welcome back, folks, to a brand new video. Europe is one of the world's most varied continents in terms of culture, history, and geographical diversity. From mountain ranges to lush countrysides, beautiful coastlines, and dense forests, there is so much nature for you to enjoy this summer. So let's take a look at 10 stunning natural wonders to visit in Europe. And before you even watch this video, don't forget to hit that like button because it is free! Number 1. Playa de las Catedrales The beach of the cathedrals. A magnificent example of nature's raw power in action. The Atlantic Ocean tides perform again and again. It's basically a living spectacle engulfing and exposing this amazing coastline sprinkled with arches and caves. It's also known as the Holy Waters Beach. A natural monument is located in Galicia, which is northwest of Spain. The chambers of these cathedrals paved with sand were formed when the Canterbury sea waves carved and carried away the softer parts of the rock. It's a really interesting location and I highly recommend that you go and visit. Number 2. Prehistol Formed more than 10,000 years ago, and the most iconic natural landmark in Norway. From the top of the 604 meters high cliff, you will find the most dramatic views that any fjord in Norway has to offer. The hike is of moderate difficulty, and in total, the 8 km hike takes around 4 to 5 hours round trip. The trail, which has significant shifts in the terrain, includes swamplands and forests and stone stairways, all built by Nepali Sherpas. But the interest in Prekestorden is extremely high, with more than 300,000 nature-loving hikers that visit the renowned rock formation every year. But please be warned, make sure that you realise that it is a 4 hour hike, and try to go with a guide, it's highly recommended and your best option. Number 3. Matterhorn Dominating the Alps mountain range, the mighty Matterhorn is 4,478 meters tall and thought to be at least 50 million years old. Instantly recognizable, thanks to its vast and near symmetrical pyramid peak. This stunning natural wonder was first climbed in 1865 by a seven man team. And today, visitors can gaze at the horn shaped peak while enjoying a scenic train journey from Zermatt. Riding along the Cog Railway to the summit of the Gornegret. So be prepared to be wild. So the most popular way to see Matterhorn in Zermatt is to take the train up to Gornegarbahn. Trains run every 30 minutes and you can imagine quite busy. But remember, to get the best views, make sure you sit on the right hand side of the train. Number 4. The White Cliffs of Dover The White Cliffs of Dover are perhaps most famous as an iconic landmark. The white chalk face, a symbol of home and wartime defence. But they have so much to offer. The views from the cliffs are perpetually changing. 
when it's gloriously sunny and the sea is calm and smooth, you can wander across the cliffs and take in the breathtaking views across the channel. On the clearest days, you may even be able to see the buildings of France. And in winter, you can watch the waves crash over the sea wall and the ferries heave in the violence of a storm. Number 5. Les Gorges du Verdon Verdun Gorge is a river canyon in southeastern France, one of the world's great canyons. The landscape is awash with overpowering slabs of white and salmon-coloured limestone that plunge nearly impossible distances to the snaking Verdun Vira, that's far below. Verdun Gorge is best seen by driving along the left bank, so if you're feeling very adventurous, and you have a bit of time on your hands, then you can try hiking down into the canyon. Number 6. Gutfoss. A list of natural wonders of Europe must include Iceland's most dramatic waterfall in the country's Hökudor Valley. An unforgettable sight, especially if you visit on a sunny day, when hundreds of rainbows appear in clouds of spray. So during the summer, the water cascades down in two stages, falling 32 meters into a deep crevice below. What's really interesting is that the waterfall can freeze into glistening ice in extreme winters. The waterfall is just a 90 minute drive from Reckon. Number 7. The Dolomites. With its 18 jagged peaks, Dolomites mountain range in the northern Italian Alps is a breathtaking sight. World renowned for their sheer cliffs and the narrow and deep valleys. So depending on the time of day and season, the mountains can change colour. Pinkish hue at dawn, or the Dolomites can turn into a vibrant red at sunset. Then of course, in winter, the ridges are spectacularly covered in snow. So my advice is to embark on a Dolomites walking tour. They're easily accessible and only a two hour journey from Venice. And there you will see other gems in the area such as the famous Lago di Braes. Number 8. The Douro River Valley Now one of the world's oldest wine regions is Portugal's Douro Valley, which is a UNESCO listed natural wonder. It's dotted with charming villages and terraces of olives, almonds and grapes, best appreciated on a Douro River cruise. So while in Porto you can learn about the age old traditions, such as the grapes which are still pressed by feet. 
you can sample the region's quality wine and ports in the city's famous cellars. Or cruise further inland, passing all the lush hillsides and soaring cliffs, so a river cruise is the perfect way to soak up the region's natural beauty. But spring and autumn are the best seasons to visit. The Old Man of Hoi Rising out of the Atlantic Ocean to a remarkable height of well over 400 feet, the Old Man of Hoi is the UK's tallest sea stack. This red sandstone monolith has been separated from land by the erosive powers of sea and of course the wind. There's a good track from Rackwick Bay that follows the amazing Hoi coastline out to a vantage point overlooking the stack. Pitbitzer Lake. So this is actually part of a national park in Croatia and is the perfect site for anyone who doesn't like to travel too far off the beaten path. It's comprised of several lakes which are the main attraction because of their beauty as well as the unique formation of the waterfalls which is cascading from which cascades down. So the pictures you will take will be incredible. And a ferry or train can transport you to different areas around the park itself. The moment you set foot in this location, you will wonder why you haven't made this trip here sooner. Well, there you have it, folks. That was part one. Big changes into the format for this channel. Soon, we can talk about that another day. As always, be good, be kind, and be careful. Peace.